I'm Judith McGee and I'm the curator of the rare books, manuscripts and artwork in the museum. The museum has a very large collection of artwork and one fine collection is that of John Reeves. John Reeves was born in Britain and as a young man joined the East India Company. In 1812 he was sent to Canton in China where he was a tea inspector. Canton at this time was restricted to Europeans, to the port only. They were not allowed into the interior of China. Canton port was a hub of activity. Ships were coming from all over the world, laden with goods of all kind, including animals and plants. It was there in the markets of Canton that John Reeves would seek out the specimens that he would like drawn and to be returned to Europe. He employed skilled local Chinese artists to draw the plants and animals. These artists came from generations of families where they were producing artwork for the European market. The drawings that they produced were not scientific. They were not accurate drawings of birds or plants if they appeared. Reeves instructed his artists to include the important features that distinguish a species from another species. The Reeves drawings are an enormous contribution to the study of Chinese natural history. Many of them are important substitutes for the specimen themselves that never made it back to the shores of Britain. And today, many scientists still refer to the drawings to see those first iconic illustrations of the subjects that they are studying.